Hello everyone and welcome back to Coral Island. My name is Melanie B. It is now Wednesday the 24th of spring. And I'm not sure what that scene was. Let's check out our task and quest list and see if we see anything new. Okay, explore the earth gate and find a way to free the earth giant. Um, did we do that? I don't think so. <laughs> uh, local produce. So, ship. Right, we haven't done that one as yet. Visiting at the lab. We still need to go finish meatling to complete this one. Free the earth giant. Explore the earth gate and find a way to free the earth giant. Okay, I don't think we've encountered the earth giant. And museum expansion. Still working on that one. Oh wow, look at this. All of our crops are already watered. Very nice. And we even got some sugar cane that's ready for harvesting. Can I get this one? This one is ready. Okay, only some of them are ready it seems. Or maybe we're just not lining up in the correct spot for harvesting. There we go. Oh. The sugarcane is a regrowable crop. That is very nice. Okay, let's see here. How much bronze quality did we get? We got two bronze quality items. So we are going to get those ones shipped for sure. Off you go and off you go. Um, we might hang on to this turnip. And the wasabi too. Can we eat the wasabi? Uh, yeah. It counts as food. So we'll hang on to that because we're probably going to go into into the mines again today let's get our hammer back out of here we'll put the trash away back and go in there too and we got our first silver bar last time so we'll stack that in there anything else we want to put away here um i should have a chest just for like forageable stuff uh, we'll keep all these items together for now, I guess. And this beetle. We can just sell this beetle all. We'll hang on to the sugar cane. Let's take something for us to eat today. I think the shiitake is going to be good. What else? Yeah, we'll go with the shiitake. So we'll get rid of this beetle. And I'll sell this potato too. Since we do not have to water today, we have a lot of extra time. Let me double check. If <laughs> I got some seeds to plant, I got a single seed. Okay, let's go ahead and plant that. I'm not going to go to Sam for any more seeds. Just because the season is almost over. So yeah, we don't want to like have anything that doesn't get ready in time so where are we gonna go today we should go see ling and then we should probably head into the caverns again is this gonna be enough energy though better be safe than sorry let's grab something else to eat let's take some morels as well and that should be good enough to get us through. So we'll head over to Ling's laboratory if we can figure out where that is. Um, that's not it. And that is not it either. <laughs> there it is. No, this is the mansion. Where is the laboratory? Okay. So it's kind of behind Sam's general store. I think we can find it. And we also have our tool to pick up today from the blacksmith. So we probably should head up there too. We'll go up this way through the promenade. What is this place? This is the lab. Oh, okay. So there is a park here. 
it's a sacred area too. And there's a couple of bugs here, but I didn't catch any of them. Oh, here's Scott. Hey, Scott. Anything new going on? Uh, no. Should I give Scott a flower? Eh, maybe not. We'll turn it into a bouquet and give it to him then. Here's Ling. Ah, Melanie B. Welcome to the lab. I've been expecting you. Have you? How come? Of course, I already know everything that happened while you were diving. You were able to activate the solar orb. I saw everything unfold from Kibble's point of view. Oh, so that little thing that follows us around the little bebop is called a kibble? I'm glad the ocean finally found someone worthy. More importantly, I owe you an explanation. About what? Please follow me into my secret lair where I can explain things to you. A secret lair? That sounds like something a villain has. Lang, I'm concerned right now. Where to start? Well, many years ago, I planted super coral, just like the one here, all around Coral Island. They've been specifically bred to survive rising ocean temperatures and hostile environments. The room we're in also holds a uh, ancient technology that can remove those stubborn oil-covered roots and heal sick coral. I think she was gonna say merfolks, but I don't know for sure. What you saw in the ocean, how should I put it? At its most basic, we take a little bit of what makes a super coral healthy and share it with all the other sick corals so they can get better. Okay. By combining human science, a little bit of magic and the ancient technology, the ocean can recover. It's a lot to take in. I'm sure you still have questions, but that's all I can share for now. The rest you'll need to discover on your own. Okay, I'm excited. As promised, the diving suit is yours to keep. Okay, thanks, Ling. But, hmm, just one more thing before I let you go. I want you to know that although you've been deemed worthy, you aren't the only one out there that is worthy. Hopefully that didn't come across the wrong way, but I don't want you to feel like this is a fate you can't escape. There's nothing worse than that. Thanks again for stopping by. Okay. And... Let's see what we can get at Ling's shop again. So we can purchase extra kelp if we need it. And right now we can purchase fertilizer level 1. We can also buy glass. I don't think we need any of this stuff yet. And we could upgrade produce quality. Oh. Silver seed item upgrade. Increases your chance to yield higher quality crops. Um, I want that. It requires 5 help essence and luck previous upgrade first okay so we have to bring in five bronze kelp essences and then we have to do the next level and next level and so on and so on okay same with the seedlings and the saplings for fruit trees okay we can get better quality hay as well that's wild and process fossil remains um, I haven't encountered any fossils as yet. Okay, let's be on our way. And since we've actually completed that quest, let's get a reward. Or did we get a reward for it? Um... I don't know. I don't see a reward. Maybe the knowledge was the reward. 
Okay, well, we are gonna have to head over to the caverns. And we still have to unlock this travel spot here. It says unravel the locked passage, donate splendor yet to be displayed. So I'm guessing splendor is something that's donatable. The trash is empty. Splendor. Okay, let's get back to our farm here. We're gonna sell the fly we caught. And probably the tulip. Or maybe we can just take it for eating. Ooh, no, I, 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 I don't want to sell this. I'm keeping my morales. This is all we want to sell. Just the fly. Yeah, the, what does the tulip give us? It's 18 energy. I think we can work with that. Okay, let's head to the forest cavern. Now, the fact that it's distinguished as a forest cavern makes me wonder if there's more caverns to unlock. And here we are. So, last time we only got to 421. So hopefully we can get further this time. I'm really not sure how far down this bird cavern goes. I'm gonna guess. I thought maybe it was 20, but maybe it's probably gonna be like level 30 or 40. Probably 40. Okay, let's smash some baddies. We've got tons of energy this time. So I think we can get pretty far. Oh, I forgot to go to the blacksmith shop to get my axe back. Oh well, I don't really need it right now, so it should be fine. No, it wasn't my axe that I got. It was a watering can. Oh, I kind of do need my watering can, don't I? Oops. Okay, well, we are down to 422. And 423 right away. Oh, there is a bunch of copper over here. Oh, there's a baddie hiding out between there. And we unlocked the shaft already. Oh, I can't get him. <laughs> oh, I can't hit him. Okay. Oh, probably now I can. Get him! He's done for. He's like some sort of turtle. These are some very interesting creatures in here. But let's keep moving down. Maybe we can get down to floor 30. That would be lovely if we can. And maybe we can finally start seeing some... Some silver. No, I'm guessing silver is probably not gonna appear to like maybe level 40. If there is 40 floors in this cavern, that is. Ooh, got a mystery geode. We'll have to get that open tomorrow. And we need to try to be a little bit more careful in wasting our stamina on miss wings. Well, one thing we're getting for sure is lots of stone. I'm sure it will come in handy eventually. There's probably things I can craft with stone that I haven't really been paying attention to. Eventually we'll get around to it though. Okay, where is this ladder? Show yourself.
Okay, let's maybe get up our combat skills a bit. Yeah, we're not having very much luck finding any ores. And definitely not much luck with the ladder. Okay, and at least we have to get to level 25 today. Are we gonna find a ladder on the very last rock there is to open? This is definitely a very big floor though. There we go. Level 25. Okay, let's see. Can I break this thing? No. Visit the band of smiles. Oh, so we have defeated 30 enemies now. A band of smiles. Oh, we got some tough meat. Okay, let's check out that quest. Is it, where is the band of smiles? Okay, maybe we'll do that tomorrow. I kind of want to spend the rest of the day making progress here in this cavern. If we can get down to 30, that would be absolutely amazing. But let's have some snacks. Morel time. One more. Okay, that should keep us set for a little bit. And I will take some bronze from here. And we'll get rid of this guy. Even though he was kind of just minding his own business over there. And let's get this mimic treasure chest guy. Oh, he hits hard. I wonder if there's like any armor we can have. But maybe once we get rid of the band of smiles, we'll get the ability to purchase. Um, better clothing and stuff for like when we go into the mines and have to do battle. And maybe we'll be able to purchase weapons as well. I guess we'll see. I should actually check out like... Can I change clothing? How do I even do that? Oh, okay, right here. Outfit, equipment. Okay, so we can have rings. And we, this shows us where we have buffs. Okay, so we can wear other clothing for sure. We just haven't found any other than our bathing suit. <laughs> okay, we don't need to wear our bathing suit whilst we're in, in the caverns here. That'd be odd. Floor 26, here we come. Ooh, this place is dark. I don't like this at all. But there is bronze down here. I like that. Let's get rid of both of these baddies. Okay, our energy is starting to get down again. Okay, let's have some shiitake. Might as well just eat all of it. Though it does fill up our health as well, so maybe I won't. Because my health isn't quite down that much. 
Okay, look at us. We're down to 427. Maybe, just maybe, we can actually make it to 30. But I'll have to stop miss hitting. Okay, there's a bunch of bronze over here. But of course, there's a baddie guarding it. Okay, 428. Let's just take out the baddies first. Oh, we are very low on energy. Okay, let's let's have another one. Let's get back into the fight. Hey, you. Got some goop from that guy. Oh, this is actually a humongous floor. I thought it was really small, and it's not. But we got the ladder right away. Okay, one more to go. I think we can do it. It's already 9 o'clock, though, so we kind of have to hurry. Come on, ladder. Show yourself, please. Please don't be cruel. Oh, there we go. We got to 30. This is the last one. Nope, there is probably 10 more floors to go. We got spikes. What is that? A trap will hurt enemies. Oh, interesting. Okay, we got 12 of those for free. Okay, I think... I'm just gonna go down to the next floor to see what it's like. But we need to be getting back home right now. Okay, it's pretty much the same. Oh, and our energy is just about toast. Let's just get out of here. And back to the farm we go. Okay, so we got a bunch of scraps that we got from turning trash into scraps. Um, do we want to put anything else away? Well, look at all the bronze we've got right now. Okay, we'll just set two aside, and we'll need some coal as well. Got 45 pieces, let's grab nine of these guys, and get those processed. Now, how much can this hold? Oh, we can only make five at a time. Okay, fair enough. And we'll get some trash in. Let's put these extra coals away. The Earth Geodes and the Mystery Geodes will have to take to Pablo and his brother tomorrow. Oh, I forgot to grab my trash. So we can take up to like 40 pieces of trash and convert it into scraps. So we'll do that. And recycle machine is full. Do we want to sell anything? I wonder how much this uh, spike sells for. I'm going to try selling one of them. And the tough meat will sell one of those too. Do we need to donate the tough meat? Yeah. Yeah, we do probably need to donate like 10. Or maybe it was 5. Let's set that aside. Earth geodes, that geode will set aside to lime goo will get in there. And we still have a bit of time.
No energy though. Let's just get to bed. Okay, what's the weather going to be like tomorrow? Another sunny day. And coral stars. Okay, um, I think we've already seen coral stars before. To bed we go. So, for today we made 312 coral coins. Let's see here. So for the spike, it sells for 50 and the tough meat sells for 60 coral coins. Pretty good. Well, that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.